Wow, it worked. Today on Eat the Universe, we're joined by former NFL player and mathematician, John Urschel. So I thought, you know, you're a former NFL player. Mm -hmm. Why don't we cook some yogurt, <laughs> right? Right. You're currently pursuing your PhD in mathematics at MIT. Mm -hmm. You are a hero in your own right. Who are your heroes? So growing up, I was a big fan of Nebula. And more recently, I've become a big fan of Thor as well. I see, so you're kind of into like the, the cosmic and like mythological heroes. I'm really into sort of like space type things. Even in math, I started out solving problems that relating to space. So I'm sorry I'm not making you a, a steak or something, but I am gonna make you something all natural, protein packed, mm -hmm. and that is cosmic yogurt. I like the cosmic part. This is a giant thing of Greek yogurt. Yes. Um, so to help us along our way, mm -hmm. I've got some stuff. I see that. These are the things that are gonna create the various elements of our, our cosmic yogurt. This is uh, algae? Algae. Yeah, but it, it it's really good for you. Can I taste it? Little dab. Little dab. Yeah. Like this? Your tongue turns blue, because... Is my tongue blue? Yeah. Wait, really? Tell me about your relationship with these characters. So Nebula, I met when I was, you know, when I was a kid reading Marvel comics. She would often be like the super villain against the Avengers. And, you know, lots of people love the heroes, but I don't know why, but I, you know, I connected with her and she was a pirate. I still, believe it or not, think that there is time for you to become a space pirate. Really? Yeah, why not? You've already got the beard. You know? That's true, the beard's halfway there. Maybe I lose an eye in right. a cooking accident. Gotta get the patch going. The day is young, my friend. Yeah. All right, so I'm gonna mix us up some colors here. So tell me about Thor. I'm a bandwagon Thor fan. I jumped on as soon as I saw the movies and I saw Chris Hemsworth doing Thor. Do you approve of bandwagon Ravens fans? I'm originally from Maryland. Oh, of course, you know, we, we welcome everybody. Yeah? Yeah, join the flock. I wore my crab belt today. Ooh, I like it. Right? It's a Baltimore thing, you wouldn't understand. Yeah. Pretty much nebula blue. Yeah, it's beautiful. Let's start assembling the dish. Yeah. Sounds good. This is our palette. Make yourself at home. All right, let's go wild. So when you were in the NFL, mm -hmm. what superhero abilities would you have liked to have had? Most people would just say Hulk, but you have to be able to think. I would have liked to have Beast abilities. Beast is that perfect medium between having great intelligence, but also, you know, great power. So did you find that, that in the offensive line, are you tasting it? Can't we, you yeah, know, yeah. you taste while you, while you make? I need to get some blue in my life. I don't know. I'm doing, I'm slacking. Actually, gonna get rid of that blue there. I was a little intimidated, but you've made me a believer. Mm. That looks amazing. All right, so we've made our space. There is stuff in space. That's true. So let's add some stuff to this. Everything here has uh, texture and funness. Um, these are pistachios. I'm, I'm gonna use some of those. Okay, go for it. Can you open those up for me? Yeah. yeah. I mean, please. May I? Yeah, why not? See what happens. Oh boy. <laughs> wow, it worked. It worked, but you might have some trouble getting that pistachio out. Yeah. Can, uh, no, it's okay. It's okay, I swear. Okay. Yeah, I got it. Okay. All right. So uh, let's just... Uh, What's that? That? Yes. So this is candied yuzu zest. Give it a try. Mmm. That's delicious. I'm... Yeah, those okay. are going in. I kind of like these. These are cocoa nibs. If you pulverize this into the, a very, very fine powder, mm -hmm. uh, it would actually emulsify with the oils that are contained in it, which would basically make 100% dark chocolate. Oh, that's delicious. Yeah. Let's... I love the way that this kind of looks like some sort of exploding star, doesn't it? You know what those are. Grapes. <laughs> oh, this has to go in. Yeah? No. That's a fig. Just look at that texture. All right, I'll pull one in too. Yours is nice and flat. I'm gonna flatten mine out a little bit. Wait, do you? No, 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 I'm, I'm good, I'm good, I'm good. Oh, how about this? This is a Japanese snack mix, and I think these look like very planetoid. Oh, I agree. This is just rehydrated chia seeds. Like, I could see this being a place where, I don't know, like maybe the Guardians of the Galaxy visit, and it's just like, ooh, this is gross. Everything is made out of that. 
Yeah, everything is made out of that. Rocket would be throwing a fit. All right, I feel like I want something else. How, I mean, come on. It's a star, right? Tell me about this. Yeah, crazy, right? So that's actually a, a candied rose. Really? Yeah, are you into it? There's only one, take it. You sure? Yeah. You're too kind. Man, Beautiful. I would fly through this place. All right, well, if that blew your mind, check this out. Wait, what? <laughs> right? Hold on. I feel like you could put that under your eyes, you know, for like a glam NFL look. Yeah, so um, you can just give a little, like from up high, if you just want to give like a little flick. That'll look so amazing on the black. Yeah, I'm gonna add a little here of the rainbow. What do we have here? That's peanut butter granola. I just love peanut butter, so this has to have a place somewhere. I, I feel it. like these look like asteroids. Yeah, there you go. All right, well, I feel like my, my galaxy is complete. Me too, I'm ready to go. Let's eat. So here we've done it. We've uh, created two edible galaxies. Mm -hmm. I'm pretty excited about this. Let's dig in. Let's do it. Oh my God, it looks even cooler as you like scrape the plate. Mm. Right? I like it. Mm. This is delicious. Who knew the galaxy could taste this good? So you're at MIT. Mm -hmm. uh, you're gonna get a PhD. Yes. What's next after that? I think I want to be a professor. I yeah. want to do research, explore the unknown. Wow. And then I want to inspire young people and show them that math is powerful, math is cool, and you can like change the world using science. I see. Yeah. I thought you would be a manager at the math store. That that that's my second option. Second option. Yeah. The math store. If people like sleep during your lectures, are you gonna tackle them? Yeah, I'm not sure I'm gonna go that strong that far, but you know, I think football taught me a lot of things, sort of when to be strict and when to also, you know, let some things go. You need to find a medium. Thanks for lending your expertise, both in uh, cosmic characters, football, and in math. What do you all top your yogurt with at home? Let us know in the comments because that's all the time that we have on Eat the Universe.